13 Health Benefits of Coffee, Based on Science Coffee is a highly popular beverage around the globe that boasts a number of impressive health benefits, not only can your daily cup of joe help you feel more energized, burn fat and improve physical performance, it may also lower your risk of several conditions, such as type 2 diabetes, cancer and Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease, in fact, coffee may even boost longevity, if you enjoy its taste and tolerate its caffeine content, don't hesitate to pour yourself a cup or more throughout the day. Can improve energy levels and make you smarter, coffee can help people feel less tired and increase energy levels, that's because it contains a stimulant called caffeine the most commonly consumed psychoactive substance in the world, after you drink coffee, the caffeine is absorbed into your bloodstream. From there, it travels to your brain, in the brain, caffeine blocks the inhibitory neurotransmitter adenosine, when this happens, the amount of other neurotransmitters like norbinephrine and dopamine increases, leading to enhanced firing of neurons. Many controlled studies in humans show that coffee improves various aspects of brain function, including memory, mood, vigilance, energy levels, reaction times and general mental function. Can help you burn fat. Caffeine is found in almost every commercial fat burning supplement, and for good reason. It's one of the few natural substances proven to aid fat burning. Several studies show that caffeine can boost your metabolic rate by 3 to 11 percent. Other studies indicate that caffeine can specifically increase fat burning by as much as 10 percent in obese individuals and 29 percent in lean people. However, it's possible that these effects diminish in long-term coffee drinkers can drastically improve physical performance. Caffeine stimulates your nervous system, signaling fat cells to break down body fat, but it also increases epinephrine, adrenaline, levels in your blood. This is the fight or flight hormone, which prepares your body for intense physical exertion. Caffeine breaks down body fat, making free fatty acids available as fuel, given these effects. It's unsurprising that caffeine can improve physical performance by 11 to 12 percent, on average, therefore, it makes sense to have a strong cup of coffee about half an hour before you head to the gym, contains essential nutrients. Many of the nutrients in coffee bins make their way into the finished brewed coffee, a single cup of coffee contains riboflavin, vitamin B2, 11 percent of the reference daily intake, RDI pantothenic acid, vitamin B5, 6% of the RDI, manganese and potassium, 3% of the RDI, magnesium and niacin, vitamin B3, 2% of the RDI, though this may not seem like a big deal, most people enjoy several cups per day, allowing these amounts to quickly add up, may lower your risk of type 2 diabetes, type 2 diabetes is a major health problem, currently affecting millions of people worldwide, it's characterized by elevated blood sugar levels caused by insulin resistance or a reduced ability to secrete insulin, for some reason, coffee drinkers have a significantly reduced risk of type 2 diabetes, studies observe that people who drink the most coffee, have a 23 to 50 percent lower risk of getting this disease. One study showed a reduction as high as 67 percent, according to a large review of 18 studies in a total of 457,922 people, each daily cup of coffee was associated with a 7 percent reduced risk of type 2 diabetes, may protect you from Alzheimer's disease and dementia, Alzheimer's disease is the most common neurodegenerative disease and the leading cause of dementia worldwide, this condition usually affects people over 65, and there is no known cure, however, there are several things you can do to prevent the disease from occurring in the first place, this includes the usual suspects like eating, healthy and exercising, but drinking coffee may be incredibly effective as well. Several studies show that coffee drinkers have up to a 65% lower risk of Alzheimer's disease, may lower your risk of Parkinson's, 
Parkinson's disease is the second most common neurodegenerative condition, right behind Alzheimer's, it's caused by the death of dopamine generating neurons in your brain, as with Alzheimer's, there is no known cure, which makes it that much more important to focus on prevention, studies show that coffee drinkers have a much lower risk of Parkinson's disease, with a risk reduction ranging from 32 to 60 percent, in this case, the caffeine itself appears to be beneficial, as people who drink decaf don't have a lower risk of Parkinson's, may protect your liver your liver is an amazing organ that carries out hundreds of important functions, several common diseases primarily affect the liver, including hepatitis, fatty liver disease and many others, many of these conditions can lead to cirrhosis, in which your liver is largely replaced by scar tissue, interestingly, coffee may protect against cirrhosis, people who drink four or more cups per day have up to an 80% lower risk, can fight depression and make you happier, depression is a serious mental disorder that causes a significantly reduced quality of life, it's very common, as about 4.1% of people in the US currently meet the criteria for clinical depression, in a Harvard study published in 2011, women who drank 4 or more cups of coffee per day had a 20% lower risk of becoming depressed, another study in, 208,424 individuals found that those who drank 4 or more cups per day were 53% less likely to die by suicide may lower risk of certain types of cancer, cancer is one of the world's leading causes of death. It is characterized by uncontrolled cell growth in your body, coffee appears to be protective against two types of cancer, liver and colorectal cancer, liver cancer is the third leading cause of cancer death in the world, while colorectal cancer ranks fourth, studies show that coffee drinkers, have up to a 40% lower risk of liver cancer, similarly, one study in 489,706 people found that those who drank 4 to 5 cups of coffee per day had a 15% lower risk of colorectal cancer, it doesn't cause heart disease and may lower stroke risk, it's often claimed that caffeine can increase your blood pressure, this is true, but with a rise of only 3 to 4 millimeters slash hg, the effect is small and usually dissipates if you drink coffee regularly, However, it may persist in some people, so keep that in mind if you have elevated blood pressure, that being said, studies don't support the idea, that coffee raises your risk of heart disease, on the contrary, there is some evidence that women who drink coffee have a reduced risk, some studies also show that coffee drinkers have a 20% lower risk of stroke, may help you live longer. Given that coffee drinkers are less likely to get many diseases, it makes sense that coffee could help you live longer. Several observational studies indicate that coffee drinkers have a lower risk of death. In two very large studies, drinking coffee was associated with a 20% reduced risk of death in men and a 26% decreased risk of death in women, over 18 to 24 years. This effect appears particularly strong in people with type 2 diabetes. In one 20-year study, individuals with diabetes who drank coffee had a 30% lower risk of death. The biggest source of antioxidants in the Western diet, for people who eat a standard Western diet, coffee may be one of the healthiest aspects of their diet, that's because coffee is quite high in antioxidants. Studies show that many people get more antioxidants from coffee than from fruits and vegetables combined. In fact, Coffee may be one of the healthiest beverages on the planet. Please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel and click the bell to be notified when we post new videos.